So here, this is kind of odd. Clarinet in B flat with the flat symbol, not spelled, you know, F L A T. But if I go to the clarinet in B flat two part or any part really, I'll go first clarinet. Uh, it's spelled B flat in brackets. A little weird, kind of takes up space. The the reason I noticed this. Ugh. Look at this massive part name. Really verbose. Especially if, what if clarinet 2 was doubling on E flat and doubling on bass clarinet? Or um, whatever else clarinet's playing, I don't know. Uh, so I found a fix. I went over here to set up. Here we have the list. Okay. Here we have a list of players. And here we have a list of layouts. A layout is just like a part. When you're switching to the flute part, you're, you're actually switching in Dorico parlance, you're switching to the flute layout, right? This way you can create parts that incorporate multiple instruments, good for percussion, or arguably, you know, you could make a flute one and two layout that has two staves and it's automatically formatted, whatever. But here's what we're going to do. We're going to change the layout name. So... Like, I could, here's the new name, Claire, blah, 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 blah. right? So I'm on Windows. I haven't totally figured out how to type sharps, flats, and naturals, but hey oh, we have a little text document. These are just copied from the Dorico forms. You can find them anywhere. I'm going to copy the flat sign, and I'm going to write, I don't know if you're supposed to put these in brackets, or if you're supposed to write, E flat clarinet or clarinet in E flat. We'll go E flat and clarinet in B flat. Ha. So that's much nicer, I think. In fact, it would be even nicer if it was B flat clarinet and E flat clarinet. I think that's cool. I wonder how you can get these to propagate like vertically, like in a list, but who knows? Cool. Now you can go through, if you're really fussy, you can go through all the transposing instruments and rename them with the flat symbol, which I am going to do because that's the kind of guy I am. Okay, I hope that's helpful.